David Bryden has a question. Yeah. David. All right, David. Um, starting to work a new area, and for the first time, I'm not able to find a good list through the county. Where would you suggest I go to get that list? Buy it or build it manually? Who wants to take that one? Not Foxy Proxy. Not Foxy Proxy. <laughs> not unless you want to talk to the male people without them knowing who you are. I don't know. Terea, what would you say? So we, I, I just, I threw out trying to go through the county. Just some, it, there was not a lot of consistency there. So we use data tree or data tree um, to get our information. Yeah, there's no consistency, nor is there cooperation. Yeah, it's... Yeah, the county has the two C's: lack of uh, uh, lack of uh, cooperation and uh, and uh, lack of consistency, consistency. And, and lack of everything else. So I agree with Taria. What, when's the last time? How many months ago has it been for all three of you since you got a list from the county? Uh, I, years. How many months ago? Yeah, twenty-four, thirty-six, seventy-two. How old were your oldest kid when you? Sixty. Yeah. yeah, 48. Yeah, long time. I haven't I haven't gotten a list from the county in forever just mm-hmm. because it takes so long to get the list and then go scrub it. And I always thought, hey, I'm saving all this money because I love Excel and I'm an Excel guru and I can go do all this. And you know what? Just buy the damn list. It's 10 cents a record and go and be no. done and get the mail in the mail. I would he say geek promotion. I think it's now seven cents. I was going to say that to you, but I didn't want to bust his bubble if he's paying 10. So <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> crap. Uh, go to datatree.com slash the land geek for your discounted rate. But uh, David here, I love that sometimes you go to the assessor website and you can pull that data yourself, that okay. data yourself. And you I can. There's still one county where I do that because I know exactly I've done it for I've done it for four years. I, I'm going to go to that county. I'm going to pull the list for that subdivision. And here we go. We're good. I don't need to pay for it. I actually haven't updated my list in like 18 months. Go so back. what about your filters? You can just keep remailing. Though. What about your filters? Yeah. Like on on Data Tree, like I can weed out a whole lot of stuff that I don't want to pull. Does the county also, or you just have to scrub the list yourself for that? No, on this particular county, yeah, but there's not much I need to remove. Not much we need to remove. Yeah. If it's a bunch of squares, right, then it's fine. (laughs) If it's, I don't want to mail over here, but I definitely want to mail over there, then the county's useless unless you're going to pull that data into Zome and start looking at it, you know, from a geography perspective but to go draw a certain my mind was blown john burnett i love you when burnett was like shut up and watch this loom of me draw a circle of where i want to be here are the reasons i draw the circle i download the list and i'm just like oh my god yes Ah!" (laughs) and that cost me a hundred dollars yeah done i'll take those thousand records i mean i can have those in the mail tomorrow through lob and lg pass done Next, I will officially point my energy towards something that will make me more money. 